When students walk through the doors of Oak Hill High School, they're going to see plenty of renovations. The finished product, though, we're told, will change their high school experience. So we had to check it out. And to give you the exclusive tour, we're spending the day with the Red Devils. But not so fast. We first have to get through the new security system. Hey, it's Dylan Fairn with WOAY TV. I'm here to get the new tour of Oak Hill High School. Okay, you can come on in. All right. And we're in, just in time for the morning announcements. Welcome to Oak Hill High School, where what matters most is us. Fayette County Superintendent Terry George is showing us around. So is Director of Operations Tim Payton. All of the high school renovations you're seeing cost in total about $1.5 million. When I first saw it, I had a whoa. The <laughs> goal here at Oak Hill is to bring this school, which was constructed in 1976, into the 21st century. This is just amazing for our kids. They're, they're actually getting an opportunity to be into a, in a bright school where it's inviting and there's tremendous academic opportunities here for them. We saw it all, a new main office, new art and music rooms, and check out this aerospace STEM lab, which opens Friday. Students are going to have a blast here, learning about the latest technologies and using this flight simulator. Once the kids get good at the desktop flight simulator that we use, then they can come here, they choose their airport where they're taking off, where they're going to land, the type of plane they're going to fly. Then it was time to throw on the hard hat. Two new schools are in the works right next door. The New River Primary School for pre-K through second graders and Oak Hill Middle School, a $40 million project ready for the next school year. And it's all because 85 workers are showing up in the freezing cold to get it done. Huge effort and it's, and it's, and it's welcome uh, and these kids deserve it. And George makes it clear he's not done yet. Dylan, we're just getting warmed up. The additions here will accommodate the new students coming in, especially from Fayetteville High School and from Valley High School. In Oak Hill, I'm Dylan Fearon, Newswatch.